I've seen plenty of videos on body armor testing, but these things actually have an expiration date. I want to know, will they perform after they're expired? This is a level 3A soft body armor, and it is five years expired. This piece of body armor is supposed to be able to stop a 240 grain, 44 magnum, traveling at 1400 feet per second. So today we're going to shoot this expired body armor with some different pistol calibers and see how it holds up. I have a 50 pound bag of sand. I wrapped it in duct tape so it won't rupture and this is going to be our human torso. CCI 22 long rifle 36 grain hollow point. Did not even begin to penetrate the vest. Remington 115 grain full metal jacket 9 millimeter. Here's where our 9 millimeter hit. No penetration. Winchester 180 grain 40 Smith and Wesson full metal jacket. Here is where our 40 hit. Nice bulge, but no penetration. Arms core, 180 grain, 10 millimeter, full metal jacket. Here's where we hit. No penetration. Winchester, 230 grain, full metal jacket. 45 ACP. Here's where we hit. No penetration, but we did put a nice dent in our sandbag. Magtech 240 grain, jacketed flat point, 44 Magnum. Here's where we hit. We did not penetrate the sandbag and we did not exit through the back of the body armor. So now I'm just curious, I wonder if it can stop this double tap 400 grain hard cast 454 casual. This is going to hurt. Alright, here's where we hit. Put a nice big dent in our sandbag, but we did not penetrate the body armor. Okay, now let's shoot it with something I know it won't stop. 122 grain, 7.62 by 39, full metal jacket. Here's where we hit. We passed clean through the vest and into our sandbag. So is it safe to wear expired body armor? It depends. This body armor was only five years expired and it still held up like it was supposed to. Stopped everything we threw at it except for the 7.62 by 39 but this vest isn't ready to stop that round. But I would say if you have expired body armor I would not throw it away because it might come in handy one day. Thanks for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you really enjoyed it, please click the like button. And if you want to see more videos like this every week, please subscribe to our channel. You can also check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All the links are in the description below. This is Kentucky Ballistics, and we'll see you next week.